Our reporting suite allows you to create master detail relationships. In this video, I'll show you how to add this to a report and customize it in design time. Like with all of our reports, users can open them in any supported platform. I'll start by creating a new WinForms application. Go to the Project tab and add a new item. Here, I'll choose our reporting wizard. On the first page, you can choose what type of report you want to create. I'll select a data bound report and click Next. I'll choose Database for the source type, click Next, and then choose a new connection. You can connect to a number of different providers. I'll choose Microsoft SQL Server, use Server Authentication, and connect to our sample Northwind database. The wizard will then ask if you want to save the username and password. I'll choose No and click Next. On the next page, you can choose which tables, views, and or stored procedures to use. To create a master detail report, select two or more tables and click Manage Relations. In the editor, connect the required key fields, columns, using the mouse and click OK to close the editor. We're all set with our connection, so I'll click Finish. If I click the Report Smart tag, you'll see here that the report is connected to the data we just chose. In the Extra Reports tab, you can open our field list and Report Explorer. Both of these are used to help build your report. The report structure is displayed here in the Report Explorer. You can also manage the data source under Components. The field list shows the tables we want to use. You can right click the data source to access its settings. I'll drag category name and description onto the report. Resize them and change the font settings. To display the data from a nested table, you'll need to add a detail report band. I'll right click on the report and choose Insert Detail Report, and then choose the relationship we created. A report can contain any number of detail reports, and each detail report can contain any number of nested detail reports. This makes it possible to create complex hierarchical data. You can add different bands as well. In this tutorial, I'll add a group header to display captions for our data fields. Right click the detail report and select Insert Band Group Header. To display column captions in the group header, select the fields you want to use while holding the Control key. Then, drag them onto the group header using the right mouse button. To provide dynamic content to the detail report, select the same fields in the field list and drop them onto the detail report band using the left mouse button. You can customize the appearance of tables using the Properties window. I'll adjust the table borders and right-align numeric fields. To use the currency format, click the cell you want to change. Then, click the button for the Format String property and select the correct format.
I'll enable the repeat every page property of the group header and set its group union property to with first detail. This repeats the group header on every page and is always printed with at least one detail band below it. To make sure master and detail content are always printed on the same page, set the keep together with detail reports property of the master reports detail band. Our report is now ready. Let's switch to preview and take a look. And here's our report with a master detail relationship. And that's it for this video. To learn more about our reporting suite, make sure to check out the documentation on our website or watch any of the other videos from our reporting playlist. You can also subscribe to our channel and watch all our latest videos. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.